Hey guys, Chris again from ClassicVWBugs.com and in this video I want to talk to you about engine tarboard insulation again. Uh, if you don't know, I do sell the three-piece tarboard insulation kit for your Volkswagen Beetle. Now this is a sedan that we're looking at, 1967 sedan. Um, now I don't sell many products on my website and this is one of the few products that I do sell. Um, and I don't do many videos trying to sell things. Um, but um, what I wanted to talk to you about today is the engine tarboard insulation. I've been selling this for a couple years now for sedan. And I think I'm one of the only few guys, if the only guy on the internet selling the waffle pattern, which is very similar to what they would have offered back then on some, some Beetles. And uh, they've been selling very well. And I have not gotten one complaint at all from the tarboard insulation kit. Very easy to install and I show a video how to install it. But over the past couple of years, people have been requesting convertible tarboard insulation. And uh, I have not been able to uh, put this out until now. So what we have here is a 1970 convertible, okay, and I've been able now to make the insulation kit for convertible. It is slightly different from the sedan. Um, it's a little bit taller in the back, and uh, it has cutouts for the hinges areas, and um, so it's, I now make it. So if any of you guys are interested in having a tarboard insulation kit done for your convertible Beetle, I now have it made, so I have the templates and I can cut them for you in the same waffle pattern. Alright, so check my website um, and check the past video on how same installation uh, is, you know, for the convertible goes you know, from the sedan. So the same techniques that I showed in the video for the sedan you can use for convertible. Um, and uh, this should work for all years. Just keep in mind, I just, I cut the boards you know, without any holes for wires and whatnot. So, because it's not year specific. Your 59 convertible might have a different placement where the wires insert into the engine compartment as opposed to, say, a later convertible like you see here. So there might be some trimming required uh, and there might be some, you know, holes you might have to punch into the tar board uh, to, to get the wires to come through. So, uh, and I have a, in that video on the installation, I show where and how you can make a nice hole instead of making it look uh, kind of jagged and ragged. Uh, you can make a professional looking hole. So, all right. And uh, coming into the future, I think I'm going to start doing the tarboard insulation for the Carmen Ghia. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, I think that's going to be something that people are looking forward to. So high request for convertible. I finally got them done, guys. And uh, that's it, man. Take a peek. If you've got any questions, email me, chris at classicvwbugs.com. Or visit my website, www.classicvwbugs.com. Take care.